Hey guys, so more one stuff I buy on that uh, flea market. It's uh, this gold plated cutlery. You see, some spoons, some fork, some knives, and uh, it's very old cutlery. And you see on the edge, the gold is already missing because the stuff is used per year. And the other side see that but uh, the reason why I take that is the I know that I don't have a, a good uh, amount of gold but if you see that the place when where the gold missing it's uh, like a missing of it's look like a missing piece of foils so I got one knife here here see that you see that the gold plate is actually rip off from the knife like foil and the knife is a very solid shape see see that place See this place where the gold missing, missing all the part. So who knows? Maybe I have a good luck with this and uh, return some solid amount of gold. And uh, here I got a free knife. I got a seven fork. See the fork is actually a lot to use, but this big one is in the is in the very good shape. I got a little knife. Uh, on this cutlery, I, I cannot read this sign here, but uh, it's a stainless Korea, and uh, I got one big spoon also. It's not too much damage. But you see the difference between that two. This one uses a lot. And I got this for this stuff for a cake. It's not the same, no mark, no any mark. But uh, I think, but maybe, but who knows, maybe it's worth something, okay? So. All this stuff I pay around a two bucks, two USD bucks. So right now this is not for uh, some earning. This is for uh, I buy that for a purpose of video. And right now here I got my sulfuric cell. This is 96% sulfuric acid. We're gonna do some reverse electroplating. Here I got bucket with water. I remove inside all the finished cutlery. And right now, let's start with the job, okay? I put the gloves. I will put the gloves on my hand, glasses on my head, and uh, we will start with the process, okay? So right now everything is turned on and uh, we're gonna start with the reverse electroplating and uh, we will see what is actually happens, okay? Okay, you see the reaction?
yeah it's super very nice and the uh, solution is turn a brown little brown immediately so maybe we have luck and this stuff is actually a good good amount of gold plating you see how solution is turned dark just from one spoon the bigger spoon of course okay you see the difference between these two pieces See the different upper part and down part. We're gonna back just a little more. Other side. Now we're gonna turn that spoon. The process can't do. Okay, that is enough. Okay, it's look, I just need a little more acid to cover all that place because I have just a little more. The solution is solid, a dark, so right now I am pretty satisfied with the reaction. So maybe we have luck and we got good gold inside. Okay, you see after only one spoon, here is our spoon, no gold on it anymore. With only one spoon we have very dark solution. Now the next item is this stuff, but this is not a stainless steel, I think it's a copper plate. See that reaction? Very nice. And it's already done. See that? Very, very nice. Right now, you see the difference? Okay, let's turn the other side, this rose.
See how it's turned black? It's actually a copper. So this is the spoon is a stainless steel, but this is the copper. This stuff is a copper. Okay. Now I'm gonna process all this stuff, and uh, I'll be back when I finish. Okay. Okay guys, after I finish I pour that solution into water and leave overnight to settle down after I decant all the water. This is my leftover slug and I got a decent amount of slug from all that spoon. Now I'm gonna filter that and the process that slug with a this time I think uh, horse men are it's been much better and see how much gold we got from all that gold plated cutlery okay Okay guys, it's time we drop our cutlery gold, this is our solution, nice color, I have some SMB dissolved in water and uh, let's go. Not quick reaction, so I do not expect too much gold here.
Okay guys, after a couple of hours, this is our gold from that spoon and that neck knives. It's not too much, look at that, but it's look pure and uh, now I'm gonna filter that and melt to see how much gold I got, okay?